Okay, so let's delete the default cube and set the camera to the front view. And then you can press Shift A and add a speaker, which enables us to get 3D sound. And then press R, X, then minus 90 so that the speaker turns towards us. And then we can press N and then I to keyframe. And then I'm going to go to the last frame and then press I to keyframe once again. Okay, and then you can just add any soundtrack. And if you have headsets on and play the animation, you can hear that the sound starts up at the left side and ends up at the right side. And this can be very useful if you have a car animation and so on. You also have a lot of different settings and these settings will decide how the audio spreads around your scene as well as the volume when it goes outside the cone of the speaker. And then to render the animation with 3D sound, you just need to select an output folder, then set it to MPEG and the container to MP4 and then make sure to add the MP3 as well. And then go to render and then render animation. And if you want to change the timing of the audio of the speaker, you can just go into the nonlinear animation settings and drag the soundtrack. And that's it for this tutorial.